Hello everybody and welcome back, and I just realized Jonah is more than likely a reference to Joan of Arc. I mean, Joan, the whale. Joan of Arc was inside a whale. Oh, gross, he's fucking in love with me. The hell, man. Just please be death. I demand it. Ah, excellent. And he's gonna heal me, I'm assuming? Mid heal, woo! Should just be using low heal, but whatever, who cares? Punch him in the face. Twice. Oh yeah, now let's see if we can't get to wherever it is we're supposed to be going. You have a hint that it's over in this direction somewhere, but that's about it. Ooh, this is cool looking. I don't remember this. Are there monsters in here? Just. Ooh, iron kneecaps. Hold on a second. Can anyone else use them? Well, Crowley can, but I mean... Oh, well, my defense is higher. Eh, fuck it. Put them on. I could logic -y make it logic for... Oh, god fucking damn. Me, you shit. Ha! He's vanished. Just, 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 just! Ultra Marine Mittens. Those sound cool. And they are gloves. They up deftness, which is good for you. Okay, I'll be completely honest. I have no idea what the fuck any of these stats do. I have literally no idea. Besides defense and attack, not a clue. I'm fairly sure I used to know, but I definitely don't know anymore. Oh, there's a crab man there. Oh, no, you don't. Sideways walks. That's amazing. Just sneak around the back of this guy. They don't seem to move. Oh, shit. Well, I'm fighting a blocked Opus. A knocked Opus. I was close. I took a stab at it. I was wrong. But I was close enough. So, that's okay. And he's down. Yeah, and they give pretty crappy EXP too. But I mean, hey, what you gonna do, I guess? Okay, through here. Chest! Hey, a mini metal! Nice! It's a heal slime. I think. Oh, it's a man of war. My bad. Here I was thinking it was a heal slime, now it's just a recolored heal slime. Or something else. <coughs> That's okay. Oh yeah, they've both got styles of sentencing now. Hey, Manimal's dead. Give me that delicious EXP and no item drop, but hey, shit happens. Okay, so what's up here? Nothing. Okay, let's head back. Uh, bad crab. Haha. <laughs> bad crab. Just gotta avoid all the crap. Thank you. Wander off a little. Fucker off. Come on, fucking devil. Whoosh. This isn't where I was supposed to go. Whoosh. I'm supposed to go to the right. Past the Noctopus. And this way. Yeah, at least I got a decent amount of treasure out of this cave. And now up. Oh, damn it. Oh, well, it's fine. I can get that after. It's just a blue chest anyway. Blue chests generally don't have anything too spectacular in them. Attack! Attack! Oh crap, we got that grits. Dem grits! And stentencing, and whoosh! Almost dead. Ow, bastard's throwing rocks. Well, at least he doesn't live in a glass house. <laughs> Reference to proverbs. 
Yay. More EXP. What's in here? Um. Okay, there's a possibility of more. Oh, crap. You're a fat frog. I kind of want to kill him, but I kind of really don't at the same time. This is what I came for. Oosh. Seed of agility. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to keep all of these seeds till I know what the fuck they do. To put it bluntly. I mean, once I figure it out, though, bam, I'm going to use them all. I'm going to tear through those seeds. Like nobody's business. Let's sneak around here. Let's take the high road first. And then we'll take the low road. And... Mini metal? Yeah. Called it. That's fine. Like I keep saying, mini metals are good. They have their uses. Nothing in here seems to aggro me. I guess I'm a higher level or something? I don't know. Pot. Ooh, a jar of toad oil. Nice. I mean, it's nothing too spectacular, but it's a region for alchemy, and, well, you always need those. Even if you think you don't need those, you need those. You need lots of those. Salamarauda. Heal. Swing. Well, he does still use his normal heal, so that's good. <coughs> hey, Salamarauda's down. He doesn't give much EXP. Or gold. But I guess not everything can be a metal slime, you know. While in Port Life and Kaz had learnt that Mayor Bryce intends to adopt Jonah Jones, however, Jonah's are unwilling and having spent the night at Jonah's house, Kaz has awoken to find her missing. Damn it, I thought he'd be gone. What a wanker. Now there's two of them. Should probably use a spell. Uh, or an ability. Nah, I'll use a spell. Crackle, go. Boosh, boosh. Boosh! Yes! See, those iron leggings are coming back to help me here. And a mid heal on Ali. Good old Ali boy. Boosh. Bye bye. Man, if you got EXP based on killing hits, Alphonse would be the highest level. Everyone else would probably be like level 2 and he'd be level 57. My level 57? I don't know, it's just the first time that came to my mind that was reasonably high. Oh shit, that's some cash money. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. I live! Fucking Salamarauders. Okay. Eh, damn it, I thought I could get around him. What's this guy called? A Mortoad. Mortoad. Sounds like Pokemon. And crackle go. Oh, he's gonna bang. <laughs> well, that was a waste of a crackle, but it's fine. How did that Noctopus not die? I mean, he will in a second anyway, but how did he not die that time? Let's get the Mortoad. Mortoad. You kill him, that's fine. Oosh. I don't know why you'd waste a crackle. Because he uses so much more mana, but. Hey, I mean, you know. I wanted to set him to AI, so it felt like I was playing with other people, and people are stupid. So, there you go. Blue chest! Iron nails. Don't think I've ever actually seen those before. I probably have, I just don't think I have. Crabbit and some Chimera. Crackle! That's fine, you can attack me all you like, my friend. Crackle! Boosh! Boosh! Oh, I can do a coup de gras! Oh no, not fire breath! Mid heal! Yes! Thank you. Ah, oh, he's calling for goddamn backup. Where's my coup de grada? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? It can't hurt. It's 
pretty much whenever I get attacked, I'll now attack back, which isn't terrible. What ha? Fancy pants. Stop wasting your goddamn mana, you wanker. I don't have mana restoring items yet. Uh, enemy are preparing to attack. Uh, I don't have enough MP for that. Um. Just gonna crack the chimera. And. dodged. That's fine. Stop using fire breath. I dodged. Didn't counterattack, but I dodged. Crack. Boosh. Now he's dead. Please die. Yes! Battle over. Could be decent AXP though, yeah? It's not bad. And decent gold too. Enemies that can call other enemies are generally decent for farming. Uh, let's get a lay of the land here. Want to make sure I don't miss any treasure. There's going to be some treasure over to the left. Because it's a dead end path. The branches off into two separate areas. That one doesn't have treasure. This one has treasure though. A pair of blue jeans. What are we, Homer Simpson? Haha. <laughs> Jokes. Blue jeans. Wow, they're pretty good. Uh, okay. So. And I'll give these to you. Beautiful. And we're gonna get in a fight with some more Chimera. You know what? It happens. And by it, I mean shit. Shit happens. In case you weren't aware. <sighs> oh, jeez. Hey, everyone gets 40 XP. Ooh. Okay, now let us go to the right, because there will be more treasure. I lied. Oh wait, no I didn't. Yeah, I did. Noctopus, why? I think I can sneak around. Yes! Victory is mine! No, 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 no. Damn it. I got so close. This is a really nice backdrop, by the way. I don't think I mentioned that. It is indeed a very nice backdrop. Oh crap, they can do a coup de gras. Wait, why did that only attack one of them? I don't get it, but it's fine, because he's dead. The next turn, Crowley will use his coup de gras. Which kind of sucks, because it means he's not going to use it this turn, and that guy is all but dead next turn. Unless Crowley can outspeed Al, which he cannot, so... That's sort of tough to taste. But it's fine. Chisness happens. Okay, up here. Hey, there's a sign. Cars reads the sign. Cuddling Cliff, Private Beach, Keep Out, by Rur the Mayor of Port Lathen. Any loots? Uh-uh. Looks like they're doing a witch burning up here. This doesn't look good. As beautiful, eh, love? I fancy you'll be able to clear your head a bit by here, and then we can have a tidy little chat. You must be awful tired with all the summoning we've had you doing lately, eh, you poor thing? Well, I wanted you to know that if you give your Uncle Price a word, I'll see that the summoning stops tomorrow. I'll just tell everyone in the village that you've lost the power to call Leviathan. Simple, see? Mr. Mayor, I... And then you can pop down by here with me once in a while, and we can have a little summon in secret. There's all kinds of coral and pearls and such at the bottom of the ocean sea, and all that treasure in them sunken ships, too. You could be asking Leviathan to bring the likes of that up for you now, couldn't you? Instead of boring old fish, eh? Pearls? Treasure? Mr. Mao, I can't believe I'm hearing this. Outrageous it is! Now, now, love, don't get all het up. I only meant every once in a while, like whenever you're feeling up to it, like. Just think about how much happier we'd all be, all rich and content, like. Rich? Contented? That's right. Back. 
And all you'd have to do is accept that your father isn't coming home. Let me adopt you. See? Simple. I'll be your new father, love. Yes, tidy, eh? No, you're not my dad and you'll never be my dad. My dad. Uh-oh. Uh, guys? Oosh! Oh, mighty Leviathan, thank you. You are our calling and you've come to bless us with your help again. Come, Jonah, start praying. Ask Leviathan to go and bring us some treasure by here. Uh-oh. Ah! J Jonah! Yikes, that was a bite from the blue. Something seriously fishy is going on here. Uh, items. Organize items. Bag. I've actually got a tortoise shell. Uh, medicinal herb. Medicinal herb. And medicinal herb. Bag. Transfer. To Al. Transfer to Al. Transfer to Al. Transfer to fire. Transfer to fire. This is a very painstaking process and give me a few to. And I will give one to Crowley, although I think if Crowley's still alive to use it, he'll be okay. And just quickly, I am going to save on my completely legal emulator. I mean, completely legal shit. Completely legal DS, you know. Wow. Da -da -da. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Leviathan. As you can see, he pretty mu he's pretty much neutral to everything. Um, except Blast, which he does slightly resist. Um, other than that, he's pretty fine. You know, I mean, just gotta slowly wear him down, and he has a lot of fucking health. Like, a lot, a lot of fucking health. So, seeing as I do, like, next to no damage, I am just going to be egging on. And that's about it. Swing! No, maybe I won't. It doesn't actually do all that much. Buff! Boosh! Al took the damage. Wait, do I have any abilities that don't cost mana? What is this guy? He's an aquatic family, which means he's not a dragon. Or a machine. I think. Let me attack next. Let me attack next. Yes! 1.5! Now you attack. No, you're gonna buff. That makes sense. I mean, you know. Oh, hell yeah, and Crowley has a coup de gras at the ready. Oh, and Al dodged. What a beast. Boosh. Al, I mean, fire's still shit. Oh, crits! Crits! Now you crits. Well, you got a bonus damage at least. No crits, but I mean, I can't help it if I'm MVP. You know? So yeah, strategies for Leviathan. You don't really need one. Just make sure you're reasonably leveled, have decent defense, and that you have some sort of healing party member, or lots of medicinal herbs. Because it is a long fight, and he will do this. That can hurt if you don't have a buff. Like, look at fire right now. Fire took a bit of damage. And that's why I gave herbs out. So yeah, other than that, uh, make sure people have a couple of medicinal herbs. Make sure you don't let their health drop too low, because that can be dangerous. And if you have it, buff. 
buff is a fantastic spell and will give a little bit of extra defense to anyone who you cast it on. Oh, crits! Now it's crits with bonus damage attached. All the crits! And a bit of staff of sentencing. Yeah, he only really has those two attacks that I know of. Um... Yeah? It's not the hardest fight in the world, to be honest. It's just... Oh, here we go. Choir of Angels. ka -ching! How overpowered would this be if it restored everyone's mana? God, I wish it restored everyone's mana. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. But yeah, pretty much, you know, he's got over 1,200 health. He doesn't have all that much mana. Uh-oh. He's pissed. But it's fine. When a boss gets enraged on one person, it generally gets a whole heap easier. Oh, crap. Idle wave. Okay, that's a good one to be on the lookout for. So I'm going to use my block and spiel, because he only has eyes for me currently. Oosh. I'm not going to do much damage this hit, but I will also take significantly less damage while Crowley is healing up everyone else. Which is good. Because he's going to hit me. See? And I took less damage because I used block and spiel. Uh oh, buffs are starting to wear out. That's not good. But he can't have that much health left, to be honest. I mean, he's got to be slowly... Ah, oh, no, you should have healed yourself. Oh, good, he's still aggroed on me. Never mind, heal me. Whatever. I don't care. Now, go! Nope, he still ain't dead. God, he's got a lot of health. Um... Oh, right. Also, um, his tail swipe... As you can see, it actually does less damage the further along you are. So, for example, like, it would have been better if I had Kaz, Al, Fire, then Crowley as my order. Because the further down the list you go, the less damage they take. And because myself and Al have the highest armor, if I remember correctly, um, it would keep, make it so that they take less damage. Uh, yeah, yeah. Leviathan, no oh, shit, no L! Coup de gras. Rough and tumble. I don't even know if that'll work on this boss. But it might. Oh, I've never even seen this work. I don't think I've ever counter-attacked anybody. Mid-heal. Swing! Damn, that heals a lot. And tidal wave, so that was the perfect time to use it. Fire of Angels would be nice right about now, actually. No, oh, nice big heal to everyone. And smack him. Yes. And he's gonna mid heal. Yep. Mid heal fire. That's good. And Al dodges like a beast. Um. Oh, please tell me that's it. Nope. Man, I've been critting a lot though. All the crits. Oh, crap. Yeah, occasionally your spells can go. I guess the easiest way to put it would be Haywire. And they just go nuts and do a lot of extra healing or damage. And it's good. It's really good. Because it's like a crit that can crit. And that's fantastic. I really wish he'd take care of himself more. Because if someone else dies, it's not so bad. But if he dies, then we're in major shit. Oh god. Fire, heal yourself. Oh, wow, Al did it. Okay. Oh, Al can use his coup de gras. That's good. Bang. Hopefully he'll use it next turn. Uh-oh. Crow's running out of mana. Fire's almost dead again. No, stop healing him. As mean as it sounds, I'd rather you fought, on, fought the boss. Oh good. Crowley's still alive, although it looks like he's going to be dying soon. Which is not good. Hey, if I can coup de gras too. Attack! No, use your coup de gras and start using fucking magic, you wanker! Crowley, yes! Crowley can coup de gras! 
Thank fuck. Full heals for all. I kind of wish he saved it for a little bit, but I mean, hey, shit happens. At least we're all still alive. That's the important bit. Now, hopefully, Al will use his Grotto Growl, which he didn't. You know, I'm just going to make him fucking do it. I don't mind too much about Fire's one. Um, misc Tactics. Ow. Follow orders. So I am going to fight. I'm going to abilities. I'm going to egg on Owl. I'm going to coup de gras with Owl. Fish wing. Oh, wow. I didn't think I could actually make a boss stricken with terror. That's impressive. Cool. Weird, but impressive. So there you go, mad strats. Make him freeze with terror. I'm just gonna make him defend for now. Oh wait, I should have actually made him freeze him in terror again. 50. I'm going for the 400. Hey, he's finally using ozone. I'll spam the shit out of his spells. Crawley takes 37 points of damage. Abilities. Egon. Alley boy. Abilities. Warcry. Ay -ay 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 -ay. He's unimpressed. Yeah, that's about what I figured would happen. No! I was gonna do like a huge hit, you motherfucker! Oh well, doesn't matter. Boo, shivering gets a thousand EXP. Fire's now level 17. His attributes improve and he gains four skill points. All into spellcraft. It's not gonna do anything this level, but that's what I wanna max out. Ooh, and Crowley's Magical Mending went up to 100, which is nice. Um, I don't even know if I want the shield skill on him. And I'm not sure if I want Wand or Staff. But by the look of it, I'm definitely going to want Wand. But I might end up taking Spear, just for shits and giggles. I'll be able to get Benediction soon. I'm pretty sure that's my res. Oh, he drops it up. Any money, it's a Moss Emerald. It's a Moss Emerald! I'm fine. You're not hurt, are you? <gasps> He's going nuts! Uh, uh, no, please, please, don't hurt him. But he's one of the mayor of Bryce's stooges, isn't he? Yeah, your voice. D Dad? Dylan, what in the name of... What is it? What the flap's going on? I'm so sorry for it. I will put you travelers through. And Jonah, I can't tell you how sorry I am for all the pain I've caused you. That night of the storm, I was thrown tidy from the boat. Like, then all of a sudden, this golden fruit drops before me. Fading, I was good and fast, so I just grabbed hold of it, see? And I couldn't... All I could think of was you, Jonah, back there on the shore. I was thinking how you'd get on without me. You've been such a young dab and all. And out there that day, right in the middle of the ocean, I died. Only next thing I know, I'm not dead at all. I'm swimming around looking like a big old whale. Shocked was I. Don't have to tell you. I, I don't. I was bringing all those fish by the village there so you wouldn't have to go without love. I never thought it would bring the rest of those gannets running like it did. I've kept out of it till now, but enough is enough. Come on, love. Let's leave this greedy village and its rotter of a mare behind. You won't have to worry about nothing once we're away from here. I'll take care of you from now on. Oh, Dad. I can't. I, I just can't do that. 
I want to stay by here and help with the fishing, see? I have to learn to stand on my own two feet. I've watched you work in all way all these years, and now it's my turn. I'll be the tidiest fisherman Port Laffin's ever known. You just wait and see. I'll make you proud, Dad. I can't go on relying on you forever. It's time I started making my own way in the world. You understand, don't you? J Jonah. Jonah! Oh, this is the other kid. Bryson? What are you doing out by here? Are you alright? I'm sorry about my dad. I was sick beyond worrying about you. I was. I had to come after you. How the fuck did he make it through that cave? That, that's your dad, isn't it? You can rely on me, sir. I'm no flag. But I'll look after your daughter when I grow up. Bryson. Thank you so much for becoming the Vithan so you could carry on looking after me, Dad. But I'm alright now, see? Jonah. I'm so caught up worrying about looking after my little girl that I never realized she'd grown into a fine young woman. If only I'd stop to notice, I'd never have to have caused you all so much trouble. I know you can do it, love, so I'm taking you at your word. I'll be watching over your every step on the of the way, mind. Good luck making your own way in the world. Ugh. And goodbye. Just remember. I'll always be by your side, love. Always. Kaz, it's a fig! Fig in hell. <laughs> Kaz obtains a fig. Thank you ever so much. You really helped everyone in the village out. Jonah, do you want to head back now? Mm. Kaz returns to Port Lathen with Jonah and company beside him, and a freshly found fig in his hands. And then, the following morning... Oh, you're awake, are you? I want to thank you again for everything you've done. You're made of tough stuff, that's for sure. When I grow up, I want to be just like you. I'll keep Jonah safe. She'll never have to be lonely with me around. I mean, everyone says how tough she is, but, well, she's still a girl, like. Haha. <laughs> oh, yeah, I almost forgot. As of today, the ferry's back up and running again. That's marvelous, eh? Very nice. Oh, Jonah. Jonah, forgive me. Leviathan, forgive me. The man's been like this for ages now, and there's no coming to him. Must have been a terrible shock he had. Well, yeah, he's sort of a giant piece of shit. Treasure chest is locked. Still locked, okay. Anyway, so, next episode we'll find out what the hell this fairy thing is about. But for now, we are going to go save and end off. Because it has already been a fairly long episode. All living creatures are children of the Almighty. What brings you to our church, child? Praise the Lord! Nope, I'm done. So, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you join this part, and I hope you will enjoy the rest of the series.